Hi there, in this video we will apply the Kramer's rule to solve the market model and we are going to do this with a general example. Here we are the demand function, the supply function and the market equilibrium condition that is QD is equal to QS. So we have to write it in the matrix form which we know is simply by reorganizing the equations. This is the demand equation in its pure form but we are now reorganizing it and bringing both of the variables on the left hand side and on the right hand side the other constant is left then we have the supply function and this is also rearranged q minus d p is equal to c so the constant is left on the right hand side since now we are converting these into equilibrium values this is why we have bar on the or on the variables that are involved uh, now we extract the various um, matrices from these equations this is the coefficients matrix this is the variables matrix and this is the coefficient uh, constant matrix uh, q1 for this q there is one for this p there is minus b and for this p there is minus d. q p is the order and a c are left on the right hand side. So for the Kramer's rule as we know that we uh, shift the first um, uh, column and we uh, bring the constant matrix in its place. So you can see that minus b and minus d they are as they were but instead of the first column that is 1 and 1 we have a and c here so this is the new matrix after the replacement whereas in the denominator the original matrix that is the coefficients matrix is appearing so the replacement matrix divided by the original matrix we can uh, solve them because they are in determinant form so the determinant of this matrix divided by determinant of this matrix minus is cancelled out and we have uh, the value of equilibrium output and for price we will do a similar procedure and the similarity is in terms of replacement however this time we will replace the second column because the second column was minus b and minus t but we will write a and c in its place so you can see in place of minus b and minus d we have a and c so this is the replacement matrix determinant and this is the matrix which is the original one and its determinant is written that it is the determinant of matrix a their values are found this is the numerator solution this is the denominator solution and we get the equilibrium price so this way we have found the equilibrium price and the equilibrium output and we have used the Kramer's rule approach here to find out the market model and its solution thank you